We play a vital role in the mission here at Seymour Johnson. Our play in the mission, we protect all the base's assets. We help the planes take off, land. We're always here on standby, 24 on. We also provide protection to the base community. We do hazmat, we do aircraft emergencies, we do technical rescue, we do medical emergencies, and we also respond to fire emergencies. We train literally every day. Every day we have some type of training. It's required as firefighters for us to maintain our certifications. Every day we're doing something, rather it is to deal with firefighting, structural wise, aircraft wise, hazmats, uh, medicals, technical rescues like we did today. The reason we have the skill to repel or do a high line, a low angle rescue or high angle rescue, we go up the control tower to save somebody or to help somebody and we can't get down now. There was only one way down and we could repel off the tower with them. So today, search and rescue training, we try to implement the different scenarios we could see in the line of duty. As far as a down firefighter going in, you could see many different things. Uh, obstacles get in your way, uh, low visibility, darkness, you may not be able to see anything at all. So the key goal is to work with your partner and trying to figure out a way to be able to get the firefighter out. Our job today was to make it around the obstacles as a team and be able to find our way through, make it to the victim, and be able to safely get him out of harm's way. I have a very big passion for this job. I love training myself and bettering myself, as long with training the younger airmen and making them better people. Not only just as firefighters, but as airmen and as people. I go to the community on their worst day, and. I want to be there to help them and that's what I love about this job.